and welcome to my channel. It's divine. I got to do that over. Hello, and welcome to my channel. This is Divine Jedi God in 717, and I am here today to do the Divine Masculine Energy Read for the week, okay? Um, I thank all of you guys for all the love, all of the likes, shares, and subscribes. All of my new tribe members, all of my old tribe members, I love you all. I thank you for all that you do. I'm so grateful that the way we're growing, I'm so... <sighs> just grateful for everything, humbled, and I'm really enjoying walking in my purpose and the way you guys are receiving me and the love that I'm receiving from you. It's just amazing. I'm just happy to be here and walk in my purpose and be divinely guided and protected on this journey and bring you guys to the light of love, happiness, and transformation, okay? Today, we're going to do the masculine. Let's get started, okay? Anything that you guys need to know is down below in the description box area. Um, readings, bookings, pricing, um, as, and, as well as a P.O. box for gifts and trinkets for our channel to grow. Um, things that you want to see on the channel. Um, if you can guys can send it to that email, to that, to that um, address, the P.O. box. I hope everybody's having a blessed evening. Let's get started. Uh, when it comes to Divine Masculine... Um, it's, the energy is really like stress, a lot of stress, a lot of, um, confusion still. Um, they know what they want to do, but they're not taking action. It's a lot of cowardice energy going on is what I'm feeling. Um. It's like a cat got their tongue, you know. There's so much they want to do and say, but they're still not moving and walking in their power, which is causing towers in their life. It's causing them to lose a lot. It's causing them to sacrifice. Uh, they're still sacrificing their gift for things that does not serve them, okay? That's what's going on right now with the masculine. Mm -hmm, look what I say. The thinking man, he's still in thinking mode. The masculine's still thinking. And overthinking, okay, about which direction to take when he already knows what he wants to do, him or her taking how it resonates. They already know what direction they want to go in, but they're still thinking because they don't want to let go of something. It's something in their life right now that they are thinking that it's, but they can't do without. They have a lot of selfish energy going on. Mm -hmm. But they know what journey they're, they know that what path they're supposed to take. This is journey upright. So they know exactly where they're supposed to be. This is why they're causing towers in their life. That's why I felt the towers. When you, because when you're not being obedient, that's when things happen. And the masculine is not being obedient. The masculine knows exactly which direction they're supposed to go in. They know what they're supposed to be doing. They know exactly <laughs> when they were supposed to do it, okay? And they are about to reap major karma because of it. That's what I, that's what I feel, yeah. They're still staying on the path with karmics. People that are sucking them dry. They're still investing and dedicating themselves to things that are not for their higher good, like I just said. The masculine is about to reap karma with this person. With the karmic. Mm-hmm. The karmic is still doing magician spells. They're still trying their desperate. They're still doing whatever they can do. And, and uh, mostly with the masculines that are, st they are living with these people, they are... Now they're feeding them in their food and putting it in their drinks and all of that. That's what they're doing now. Mm-hmm. They're doing more binding spells. Mm-hmm. Where they are, they're not in a happy family. They're not in a happy situation. And this person, if they have babies by this person, is not their children. If they're currently pregnant right now, it's not their baby. If they have a baby by them, they need to get a DNA test. And they're not happy. They're ten it's the Ten of Cups in reverse. The masculine knows exactly where they are and where they're not supposed to be, but they're still staying there. They're still thinking about taking the right journey because here is still fun. It's, it's, it's about control. Yeah, but the masculine's about to outsmart themselves is what I see. Mm -hmm. The community in reverse. The, com the community is now starting to see 
what the masculine and this karmic is about. That they have been, they have built a facade. It was not nothing real. It was never true. And this was all built on a faulty foundation. The community is now seeing that they've been false flagging. Mm -hmm. If they haven't yet, they're about to. <clears throat> Somebody is stressed out here. The masculine is very stressed. Like I said, it's stress energy. Very stressed, but not making a decision. Know which way he's supposed, him or her is supposed to go, but they're still not doing it. Yep, because they're avoiding healing. The, the masculine does not want to heal, guys. Okay? Afraid of success. Afraid of growth. Afraid of change. Afraid of transformation. Afraid of healing trauma. That's why they're still staying in a karmic situation because the karmic is unhealed too. And everybody in their environment is unhealed. So they don't have to hear that. They don't want to hear the person that they're supposed to go on this journey with tell them how they're supposed to heal. And that person's supposed to help them heal. Their actual Ten of Cups is outside of this situation. But this and their happiness. This is if this was upright, it'd be happiness and healing. The person, their ten of cups, the person that's supposed to help them heal and get out of this depression and anxiety and, and sluggishness, laziness is not in this community. But this is where the master wants to stay in the, the in the reverse. In the in a, a, a unhealthy situation. Yeah. Full of envy. That's where he wants to stay. He's jealous of divine feminine instead of and looking into the light of where he's supposed to be, but he's not walking there. That makes no sense, right? I don't think so either. It don't make any sense when you can, yeah, because he's the one not walking away into where he's supposed to be. So how are you going to be jealous of your person, of your actual counterpart, the person that you're supposed to be going on a journey with? How are you going to be mad at them? Because they're moving forward into you guys' abundance alone. That makes no sense. Yes, the universe is impatient. They're done. The masculine is gambling here now, guys. That They're really playing with fire when it comes to their future. Yeah, they are. Mm-hmm. What did I say? Karma at the bottom of the deck. We have to make some room for this. We're going to have to make some room for this. This got to come on the board. Wow. We got this got to come on the board. Okay. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Karma for what? Not going into their cornucopia. Not walking their truth. They're losing all of this abundance. You see that? This is the masculine is gambling. Yep. Gambling cornucopia. That's everlasting love, everlasting happiness, everlasting finances, everlasting peace, everlasting joy, everlasting prosperity. They're giving it up for karma. That's what they are right now, guys. Gambling, destiny for karma. That's going to be the title. Yep. Okay, let's get moving, masculine. I'm not even going to fuss. I'm going to fuss if I have to, but yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. The Queen of Cups. Divine Feminine. Mm -hmm. Yep. And who else? The Empress. Divine Feminine. You see that? That's what they're gambling. Mm -hmm. For the community. We're going to take both of those. Yep. And they stand. Well, look, at the, look at Spirit speaking. <laughs> look at Spirit. We got all these cards coming out. Oh, my God. I'm gonna take all of them. I'm gonna take all of them. Yes, yeah, spirit said take them. So I'm gonna take them and put them here. So what they what they are? Uh huh. Yeah, all of them. Yeah. Yep. Wow, they all make sense. Wow. Okay, here we go, y'all. So what we got is the masculine is gambling. His or her take it how it resonates to your story. They're queen of cups for the community, for what the community said. And listen to what people said about this person here, okay? The person that, that is actually their ten of cups, that's actually their balance, that's their true woman holding coin upright. The person that they are with is in the reverse, which makes them a karmic. Happy family ten of cups in reverse, which is, makes it a karmic contract. Justice in reverse. 
which equals karma, okay? This masculine is overthinking about karma, letting go. He's stressing out about letting go of karma to go to abundance with a queen of cups. That makes no sense, right? That sounds like a brain scramble. That sounds retarded. I'm pretty sure that's what you guys are getting from this. There's, but, but then, and then on the other hand, they're stressed out and, and, and anxious about the empress. Because they now realize who their empress is. Or emperor, take a high resonance, whoever's in the masculine energy. The empress is fertility. This is growth. This is someone who's going to pull, they can pull the masculine out of all of this. Everything that's in reverse will be upright for him or her. If they chose the correct person to be with and invest into, they know that they are not choosing correctly, okay? They know exactly what they're doing, but because they, they have a certain lifestyle in this karmic world that they don't want to give up for this person here because they feel like that they, they're like, I want my cake and eat it too. I got to have this person. And, and also the other things as well. When these two people here is the same person, this is everything you need right here. The master does not want to transform. They want to do it halfway. Okay? Yeah. They want a victory and not healing. This is a, this is a, the victory card. The six of wands is ego and pride. This is what's going on here. The masculine is about to lose everything for their ego. And the pride before the fall is about to happen. Because they're supposed to be healing. This is the emperor. This is the twin flame. He's supposed to be in healing so that he can transform and receive his abundance and happiness. Why we have healed the door to healing and happiness. But they want to walk around in this victory situation, thinking that this situation that they're in, this karma, that they're that this cesspool of death that they're playing in. They want to sit here and act like this is a victory instead of healing and following their path of where they're supposed to be. But behind the scenes and behind the mask, they're very stressed out. Very stressed out. Like depressed, like heart issue stressed out. Headache stressed out. And they're still trying to false flag for the community, but the community is starting to see the difference in them. They know they're in love with somebody else. People are starting to notice that, that, that their heart is on something else. Their mind is on something else. Yeah, the master also knows that their victory is with their empress. But they're not. They're thinking about it. They know where they're supposed to go, but they're not moving. Okay? And the, the person that's hating is jealous of the empress and the queen of cups, which is the same person, the divine feminine, is their hermit. A queen of wands. This is what the master is choosing right now. He's, he, don't, he don't want this person, but they have a lot of behaviors that they, that this person allows them to do. And I'm not saying like you tell you box somebody around. It's just no boundaries, no respect, no integrity in this relationship. It's, this is an open relationship where as long as masculine comes home, they can do what they want to do. You, this is that type of person because while masculine has gone, this person's doing what they want to do too. You see what I'm saying? This is how they want to live in a cesspool of nastiness. Where they can do what they want. Because they think that that's control. They think that the empress will be too much of a person to have too much, too many rules. When it's not rules, it's about respect and integrity. Individualism, understanding each other, being there and being real partners. And But yet, this person here, the person that they're with, is jealous of their life. They're empress. But the masculine is not understanding that this person right here is behind. See, they're behind the envy. They're jealous of behind the light. This is the same person. This is the person that's dragging the masculine into the darkness, darker, deeper and deeper away from their light. And not even have them jealous of their light, which makes no sense because divine masculine and feminine are the same light. They are the same. One half of the other soul equals one. Two of cups. Twin flame. The masculine is gambling heaven on earth. 
That's all I gotta say. For the for for this is this is this is like spiritual warfare here. The masculine is going through major spiritual warfare. Yeah. And he's gonna lose. If he stays in this position of thinking, man, it's gonna be a tragic loss. Mm-hmm. Yeah. And he's not walking away from the situation that he's not supposed to be in. He's, he's not walking away, but then he's stalking divine feminine 24 7. He's watching her or him. Take it how it resonates to your story. 24 7. It's a lifestyle that Maslin don't want to give up. It's something that Maslin does not want to give up in this situation. And this person knows what it is. That's what they that's why that's how they're keeping him there and keeping him stuck in his head. Mm hmm It's something this person knows. This Queen of this Queen of Wands knows something. And they're so jealous that they might tell it. And they keep that the masculine is staying here to make himself believe that this is a true thing. Well, but really his mind is somewhere else. Page of Wands, Page of Swords, stalking and feminine. Mm-hmm. But the universe is coming in. We got the patience in reverse and patience. Because the masculine is staying in the hangman position. The masculine energy shifts so much. They are so unbalanced, y'all. Last week they was in love running towards the feminine. Because it's probably because it was the holiday. This week they stuck. Don't know what they want to do. They're in their ego. This ego is killing the masculine. It's about to destroy him and destruct their whole life. Because the universe is done. That's, that's one thing that's not changing. The patience is not there anymore. It's now in reverse. It's been in reverse for the past couple of weeks. Because he's standing in hangman mode, which is ego. Not changing perspective. Not looking at things from a higher perspective. Not looking at things the way he's supposed to. Mm -hmm. And not respecting his two of cups. Not respecting it at all. Not respecting his gift. This is a gift from above. This is also a twin flame union, soulmate union, life partner. Mm -hmm. This is not something you get every day. And he's choosing this week. <laughs> you know, I got jokes. He's choosing this week to be invested in the karmic. The karmic feels it. Every time the karmic feels it, they put more, they try to put more food, something in your food or something like that. It's a lot of bullshit. Mm -hmm. And here we go again. On top of anxiety. On top of anxiety, y'all, look at this. Stress. More stress. <laughs> Can't sleep. Nightmares. Stressed out. Can't rest without his without his or her empress. Okay? But then acting like that's not what they want. They they deceiving themselves. The mass masculine is in serious self saboteur energy. Yeah. Yeah. And and not investing in healing and thinking they're gonna have a victory. Not investing in their healing. Seven of Pentacles in reverse. Not investing in healing. But want a victory in life. Okay? Fronting like they got a victory. They don't. They losing big time here. The master is about to lose out major. Okay? Yeah. Look. And the master, the reason why he's jealous. Let me show you. The reason why, y'all. See, the tea is spilled. Okay? You already know. The tea got to come through. I know it's your too. The tea has to come through, okay? The reason why this person has drugged the masculine to be jealous of their own light and make them think that this that 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 their counterpart is different from them and think they better than them or they think this and that or anything that whatever the gossip and hate is, the envy, the jealous. Envy is, is in the Bible as one of the seven deadliest sins. Um but this demon that they're dealing with, this karmic, they are they have drugged the masses so deep into believing about the jealousy between their counterparts. The Queen of Cups, mind you, is the is the that is the nicest queen, the most loving, nurturing queen in the mother effing deck. Okay. This person has no drama, okay, unless you come for her. And she's also the empress, which you don't want to ever come for the empress. That's that's the goddess of love. So they don't have any issues or hatred in their heart. As long as you stay in your lane. And I'm speaking from this because I'm an empress. And the queen of cups. I'm a Scorpio. This is what 
they have drugged the masculine through sex magic to make them believe it. And what it's doing, what it's done is this backfire that made both of them, both of them are sex addicts. We got two sex addicts here that are very jealous hearted and envious. This feels like two, the masculine is turning into a karmic, a karmic masculine and then his karmic. Mm hmm To be, to have envy, this is on top of envy. And they going out, taking advantage of people and playing sex games and all that other stuff, pimping and all that other shit. That's what they're doing right now. Yep. The masculine is about control. The king of wands in reverse is, is very controlling. Very, a, a huge ego. A lot of pride. Don't want to hear shit. They just want to run everything. And all about the pipe. Pipe you down or and, and the queen of wands fucking suck you down. Both of them is hoes. They both do. They're both outside the house running the muck. And then jealous. That makes no sense, right? Mm-hmm. Yeah. And your mask in this walk. Look at this. Not walking away. They're confused as hell. Stalking. Because they want to move away. But not doing anything, right? Mm, interesting. Yeah. <laughs> and they're getting in trouble. The universe is done. The, 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 the spirit is speaking. The universe is done because they're, they're in hangman mode. And they're not. They're still trying to crumb. Breadcrumb the, the damn empress. And the Queen of Cups, they got life fucked up. They want the situation's imbalanced. It's been imbalanced for too long. Universe is done. We are now having a problem here. On line one, it's a, it's a problem. And the universe is about to come in and spank some ass. It's about to be some major loss here. We have the fucking justice in reverse. That's never that's imbalance. Then we have then we have the six of pentacles in reverse. That's imbalance. No giving and receiving, but want to receive everything. The king of wands. That's all that's all they care about. Me, 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 me. And then they got them somebody that's me, 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 me. And then they're jealous of anybody that that gets anything else. Have you ever heard of what you what you what you're around is what you become? They 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 chose a thought, a hoe, and now they're one. Okay? That's how it works. And they want to stay in that energy because they know with divine feminine they gotta do right. <sighs> yeah. That's what we got here, y'all. The masculine is silly and being real dumb right now. You, you are that he's they're they're really gambling a gift for trash. They've gambled it. Mm-hmm. They've gambled it. Yep. Mm-hmm. For the devil. For devil energy. Yep. The devil versus the two of cups. You see those two couples on there? This is a perfect this is a perfect, perfect, perfect card way for me to show you guys. The devil, karmic relationship. Higher power, Lord God, whoever you believe in. Godly relationship, heavenly relationship. Gift from above. The devil has a hold. Okay? Karmic relationship versus this is what the masculine is choosing. This is the competition right here. Yep. Yeah. Karma versus blessings. And the masculine is, is, is juggling. Has to think hard. Thinking man. there's a This is a hard thinking process, my people. <laughs> Which one would you choose? Okay. The masculine's puzzled. They need help. Could we take a poll, y'all? Get the fuck out of here with that bullshit. That's ridiculous. That's just idiocracy. I don't, I don't give a damn if it's a word or not. It's the truth. <laughs> yes, the Knight of Pentacles taking forever to move towards, but what? But but can't sleep at night. The masculine is imbalanced. 
One, can't sleep at night, stress the fuck out, missing their empress on top of the empress, but moving slow as fuck towards the empress. That makes and, and then stressed out, anxiety, stressed out twice on top of there. Yeah. Uh-huh. And not investing in healing and but want to vic but think they're gonna have a victory over nobody telling me that I gotta heal, you know. Like they're a regular person. This is a divine masculine. This is a counterpart of a twin flame union, which is div a divine couple, a divine union here. He, the, the masculine telling the higher power that what they're not going to do. Okay. Uh-huh. And still think they're going to have a nine of cups. But then they're drinking a lot, too. They drink. They're alcohol. They're alcoholic. Whoever this is drinks a whole lot. Drinks too much. And they try to hide it, too. They don't want to heal that, either. They, they probably say that they will. They'll stop for a day or two. But they're they not letting that go either. This person believes that their, their vices, their codependencies are <clears throat> their best friends. They, they think that they can really control it, but they're not in control of anything. This person is out of control. Mm-hmm. Yes. And, and what people don't understand, the issue is why they're jealous. Is what they don't understand is when, when you sleep around, when you're a whore, okay, and when you're, well, see, this person here is not divine. This is a karmic. They're going to be a whore regardless. This is a succubus Jezebel. That person's going to be a whore regardless of whatever goes on. They came back here just to do what they're doing right now, to destroy people's lives and unions and happiness through their pussies and dicks, okay? And and with sex magic, you got to use some help because nobody would want them without that, okay? That's the issue here. Now, this person, the divine masculine, King of Wands in reverse. The reason why they're broke is because they're, they're, they're using all their energy. Every time they skeet or come, female or male, they are giving off their finances. They are giving up their finances. They are wasting energy and just spilling it out. They're supposed to be taking this energy in the upright and investing it into their feminine. They're supposed to be, because twin flames are also alchemists, okay? That's why it's called twin flame. You both light flames, passion. And when you ignite, you explode, right? Which makes what? Alchemy. Manifestations. When, that's why you make love. When twins make love, they manifest. You grow. That's why a lot of times when you make love, if you have made love with your twin, you sweat a lot. Because you're igniting, your Kundalini is <laughs> ready <laughs> for you to make that money. That's how y'all get the Ace of Pentacles. That's why you guys are so abundant together. Because you're manifesting together to grow and walk in your purpose together. That's what's going on here. But this person is like this. The masculine chooses to be like this. They have to think about if they want to be in reverse or upright, which is retarded. That's that's the issue, and that's why their punishment is about to be very harsh. Mm hmm Yeah. That they, they want they want to they're they're walking away. They want to they're not walking away. They're stalking their feminine, stalking like I mean really stalking. Okay, because they want to move towards them, but they're not making the move. Wanting and doing. This is this is in your head. This is six of swords. This is head shit. Probably it's a whole lot of Gemini on this board. Sun, moon, and rising. And we got some pentacles here too. And some cups. We could be Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces. We, could, we got Capricorn, Virgo, Taurus. And we got um, Gemini, Aquarius, Libra on the board here is what I'm seeing. Yeah, that's what we got so far. Yep, that's what we got so far, y'all. So that that's um take it how it resonates to your story. They want they want to move away, but they're not. They're just sitting there, actually moving away. What they're actually doing is moving away from the ten of cups. They're about to see that. You see how they're not going towards the same direction. They're looking towards their ten of cups, but they're not going that direction. They're not moving. They want to. It's in their head. They're not doing it though. And, they're, and, and then this is right next to the um, impatience, the tower coming in and, and making it happen. Yeah. It's about to happen quickly, too. 
Yeah, your person wants they, they want to balance it. They want to stay a hoe. They want to stay a hoe. Okay. Your person this week wants to be a hoe, y'all. In and out, in and out, in and out. They don't want to, they want to have hoes and want to be a hoe. And don't want and want to be in and out to different people versus healing. Your person is avoiding healing. That's why you guys are having an issue. And they're and if your person actually is not feeling well within themselves. They need to heal. They really need to heal right now. They're not happy. They're miserable. They're hurting. They're suffering. They're going through a lot. And they're, they're feeling hopeless instead of actually doing something about it. That's what's going on right now, y'all. All right, let's get a little bit more here. Some other more teeth so we can get clothes on out, masculine. Yeah, the masculine is confused <laughs> about the devil or about a karmic relationship versus a, a, a destined, blessed relationship where you have abundance. Yeah, the, the tower is about to come in anyway and make them release. Here comes justice. Mm-hmm. Yeah, here comes justice. Yeah. And your person has, they're, they're only been slow in the Knight of Pentacles, but, have, but stressed the hell out because they don't have the Empress because they have not been moving towards the Empress. They have not been persevering. They have not been putting any effort in when it comes to the Empress. Mm -mm. And they have not been using their wisdom when it comes to healing. This person is a pessimist. This That's a water sign. And Cancers are known to be pessimists if this is a water sign, okay? They are known to be pessimists. They have wish fulfillment with the Empress, but they are drinking and not making a move and not investing. Mm hmm Not investing. I think they think that they're gonna still have a victory, not healing. The universe is done with that. We're playing with them. This person, this person is really playing games. Mm-hmm. They're not being wise at all, not using their wisdom. Yeah. And they did all of this for clout. All this envy, all this sex capades, all these games was for vanity, okay? That's what they did it for. They chose, and, and now they are, because of vanity, everybody around them is they that they chose over their feminine. Now the masculine is losing financial ruin. And now they're jealous. They cause their self financial ruin, but they're jealous of the feminine for doing the work. That, that makes no sense. That's totally this person that they are with that is influencing their mind. But they, they, they got sense. They know what they're doing. Yep. Mm-hmm. And because they're not walking away and they're just standing their head and stalking, they're going to eventually find that, that the, the feminine is going to be gifted a ten of cups, regardless. So if this person does not just, just stays in their head, because we got two stay in their head cards, and stays in an unhappy situation and does not want to move, justice is still going to be served for the feminine. The feminine will still receive a ten of cups relationship. Mm -hmm. And the masculine won't have any joy by watching that happen. Mm -hmm. Yeah, because balance is about to be brought to the situation. Balance. And on top of patience, that for them being sporadic and not moving and, and being very egotistical and being in and out and in and out and being immature and still wanting to be a whore versus following their path and doing what they're supposed to do, the masculine is going to reap karma. There we go again. It's right here twice. The universe is not playing. It's over. Okay? Justice will be served. And people think it's a game. You everything that they everything that happens in their life every single day will fall apart. You stand in your ego and pride trying to prove something, it's not gonna do anything. And it's push it's gonna push the masculine into isolation. And it may not be the isolation that they want. Oh my gosh. Yeah, something with justice. Something could be with the court system as well. Some masses could be going to jail. Yep, there's about to be a change. They're about to be forced to release. Release this devil energy. Something's about to happen and make them have to. Hey, Pop Smoke in the building. He always coming up in the readings. Hey, Pop Smoke. Perseverance in reverse. And immature. They were very immature. They This person, this masculine. They call themselves punishing the empress by not making a move towards them. Okay? 
They want to they want to control. This person is used to controlling people or making themselves feel like they have have to feel like they're in control of a situation in order to stay in it. They chose the karmic situation because they felt that they were in control when in reality they weren't. They were manipulated. And they only was manipulated because they were immature. Okay? They moved towards the wrong situation. Mm-hmm. And they didn't use their wisdom at all. They thought that a karmic was was wish fulfillment. And now they're just an alcoholic. Stressed out and want to be aware of them. They have to be drunk to be around this person. That they're trying to overthink if they want to stay here with, okay? And if they have if they have a child by this person, because the Empress in reverse is not fertility, okay? No growth. You are not the father. They need to get that checked out. It keep coming up in every reading. I'm gonna say it every time. Yeah, the masculine is not using their wisdom wisdom at all. Mm-mm. They about to learn today though. Mm-hmm. And the community about to turn on them too. Now that they that they pinnacles about to fall or they lose, they either about, are losing them now or about to lose all of their money. Financial, this is total ruin. Something major about to happen. And it may have to do with sex and finances. Their money about to be messed up, though. Mm -hmm. And the community is going to um, change on them. Because now they're not Mr. Big Shot anymore. The picture is not painted the way it was before. Mm-hmm. Yep. And they're going to be in deep despair. What did I say? Since, since they, they, the master wants to sit back and watch and not move towards the feminine, just stand their head thinking, man, the feminine is about to get somebody else. Ten of Cups. Okay? Yes. And despair, upright, joy in reverse. There will be no happiness. Because they were not loyal. And they not walk their actual path. A gift that people don't even get. Okay? This is something. A two of cups twin flame relationship. You don't get that. A true empress. Yeah. They want to be sporadic. And, and be immature. Again. Like a, like a middle school, high school boy. Or girl. Just jumping on dicks and jumping in clips. Instead of, instead of doing what they're supposed to do. And balance the situation out. They want to be stubborn and prove a point. Okay, and the universe say no, and since you're gonna do that, what we what we got for you is some karma. Okay, that's what's about to happen here. The masking on everybody, every everything that they everybody they date is gonna be like this, immature, male or female. They will not get another device. It's all, you only get one twin flame. You only have one twin flame. You only have one divine counterpart. Everybody else is soulmates. You have a false flagger here, a false twin. And the masculine knows that it's a false twin, and they still stand stuck there because this person has something over their head, something sexual over their head. Yep. It's been coming up, and I'm sorry, y'all. I've been listening to all my booze, too. And they say the same thing. It's been coming up about all these different secrets about these masculines and these karmics know the secrets. That's what they're using. The, uh, the magic and everything is wearing off. They're using these secrets to keep the masculine stuck in their head because they don't want them to tell. But the, they don't, the thing the masculine don't understand is, is that that's the way it's designed for them to choose which side they're going to be on. When you don't choose, you still choose. Okay? And it's going to bring no courtship. You're going to have to work for everything. Yeah. It's going to always bring extra karma. More karma, more karma, more karma. Okay? Yeah. Because they, they, they chose, they, they knew who their lover was, but they chose the wrong one. Lover in reverse and the false empress. Mm -hmm. Because of what the, they thought that this better person was better for the community, for vanity, and will get them finances, but that will be a no. Okay? That person is a bum. They chose a bum. Okay? Somebody who can't even build, 